Bosha, welcome back, guys. We got quiz number two. We got the Juder in the call. This is Find Your Role, Star Wars quiz. JT said off rip that he thinks he's going to be a bounty hunter. We'll see what happens. No. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Make sure you got a pen and a paper handy with you. We're using the sticky notes, the pilot, and let's get into it. Paper or something to keep track of I'm your using answers my fingers and, and toes. <laughs> After each question, select one response that aligns time, with how you choose to be in the Star Wars universe. It will then reveal how many points each response is worth. Add that number to your tally. At the end, we'll add up all the points from the questions to determine obvious, which result you got. All right, so. let's begin. Oh yeah. Question Related one. answers. You can help a Jedi by winning a pod race. These junk dealers must have a weakness of some kind. Me, me. Everything here revolves around betting on the ah, races. I'm a gambler. Greed can be a powerful ally. The Jedi, that it is not in your interest to help them. B, agree to help, but then sabotage the race and take all the winnings for yourself. <laughs> C, try your hardest to win to help, but if you lose, at least you tried. D, do not worry about the Jedi. His problems are <laughs> not your concern. E, win no matter the cost. This way, you are contributing to the greater good. Boo. E. Kidding me? Plus I'm a, four. I'm a winner. Question two. A Jedi gives you a lightsaber and wants you to help him. The fuck you want me to do this? <laughs> Fucking look at, I'm looking down there like a shot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How this thing works. <laughs> learn the ways of the force gladly if you're to come with me to alderaan i'd love do to come a help him doing so is the right thing to do a listen b return the lightsaber you <laughs> can't get involved you have work to do definitely c, not b for you take the lightsaber finders keepers he c, gave it to you decline and steal the lightsaber might fetch a good price with the jawas e agree to help but only if he agrees to help you unlock secrets about your past you can't do C, he'll just fuck you up. I'm going D. A. I'm going A. Whole 10. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> he'll fuck you up. Three. Two strangers approach you requesting your assistance to get off the planet without Imperial entanglement. What's the cargo? Only passengers? Myself, the boy, two droids, and no questions asked. You'll fuck yourself, old man. Let's just say we'd like to avoid any imperial... Old man. <laughs> Do you, A, agree to help them discreetly? Everyone deserves a second chance. B, second chance? In. Your allegiance is to the Empire. Not B, I'm no snitch. C, do not converse with them. They will only cause you problems. C. D, destroy them. Sure. They're sneaking around. They're probably scum anyways. Rebel e, scum. agree, but only for the right price. After all, this could endanger you as well. I would do C. I don't like being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I would do C. That's four. Question four. You're making a bet to free two slaves. I'm betting heavily on the Sebulba. Sebulba. <laughs> I'll take that bet. Bro, I can't wait to see this in the theaters. I wager my new racing pod against, say, the boy and his mother. No pod is worth two slaves, not by a longer shot. Do you, A, take a bargain that only frees one of them, choose the more important of the two. <laughs> B, do not bet, but rather pay to free both and let them go. C, bet for both of them, you will not separate the two. D, threaten them to give you both of the slaves for free, or else. E, skip the bet, you figure you'd rather not get involved with D. anything. I'd go B. 21. Question 5. Jabba the Hutt is at your hangar uh, uh, asking for his money. <laughs> what a bot. That's what Judah would say. <laughs> hey, get away from my ship, man. What are you doing? There's your goat on the left. The Do fucking you, the lady. Hey, sneak out the back yeah. door. If you're not there, Built. you don't have to pay back the money. No, nah, Greedo's dead. Hey, take one of his thugs hostage. The cost of some lady. <laughs> See, 
Try to strike a deal. You know that he's a businessman. T. D. Shoot him with your blaster. No problems with that. E. Pay it back. He was kind enough to lend it to you in C. the first place. Question six. You're Ooh. out with your friends at a bar on Coruscant. Hell yeah. A sketchy character offers you some death sticks. Hell no, man. Leave me alone. Do you? A. What do you boy? Say no and force persuade him to rethink his life. B. Ignore him and go on with your evening. C. Take his death sticks and break them. Drugs are bad anyway. D. Pretend to meet him in the alley for the deal. <laughs> then kill him. One less scumbag out there. All right, Batman. <laughs> Problem of his death sticks. Time to expand uh, his operation. I guess. I guess A. Theoretically. Thirty. Question seven. A Jedi tries to barter with you to free his friend who is your prisoner. You will bring Captain Solo and it will be you. Do you A let the Jedi's friend go for free? You don't want to get mixed up in Jedi I'm affairs. Up a fight. B barter for a ridiculous price. They better pay it if they want their friend back. C ignore them. You like having their friend as a piece of art. D accept the deal for a reasonable price. You will not go up against a Jedi Knight. D. E, throw the Jedi in with your Rancor. E. That will be the last <laughs> time he tries to barter with you. More accurate. Two. Fuck. <laughs> You're in the mud. Question You're getting relegated. Eight. You're working with bounty hunters, and you realize their hostage is innocent and has been taken against their will. None of this no was my gaff. I never asked to be ripped away from my home. My family. Boo -hoo. You'll never know what it's like. Funny you say that. Do you A Kill em. agree to help the hostage escape, but only if they Kill can em. help you out as well. B try to ignore them. It is just a job. Kill C them. Kill the hostage for being yes. annoying. <laughs> C help the hostage escape. You won't be a part of this sure. job. E Threaten them to keep quiet. I'll do D. I'll do D. I'd get that. Uh, I'd feel the morality of it all. Question nine. How did you get involved in your role? A. You just sort of fell into it. B. You worked hard from a young age. C. You manipulated others until you got it. D. You followed in your parents' footsteps. Mm, probably A. A. Yeah, I fell into Oh no, I got you! <laughs> oh, that was my third day out here. Question 10. What is your weapon of choice? A blaster. Lightsaber. lightsaber. Come on, man. B, the Force. C. Blaster. D. Your words. <laughs> Anyways, I started blasting. All right, that was the last question. All right, how many Good did you get, John? Finishing the quiz. Fifty-six. Now just add up all I the points 23. and we'll find out which result you have in the Star Wars universe. Between ten and eighteen, you got Peacekeeper, a pe who was responsible for maintaining peace and order. Ooh, fucking nerd. Within the galaxy, they would be tasked with duties such as enforcing laws and investigating criminal activity. As a peacekeeper, you would be well respected. Between 19 and 25, I'm a senator. Got senator. Yo, uh, Elmer, senator Elmer, was an Elmer. individual who represented their planet, system, or sector of the galaxy in the Galactic Senate. They're involved with many political well, aspects be a Jedi. and would often fight a for freedom or peace for their planet. <laughs> As a senator, you would be very charismatic. Between 26 and 31, I am you got plugging scavenger. Scavenger the senator from Naboo, though. Gotta be honest. Discarded items and parts. They would often search wreckage from disaster or battle sites and then either sell or use the items or parts. As a scavenger, you'd be able to fix anything. Between 32 and 37, you got soldiers. Man, that'd be a tough soldiers one to, an to fall into. In defense of an organization, <laughs> government, or ideal. They were well trained and highly organized when it came to combat. As a soldier, you'd be ready for any combat situation. Between 38 and 42, John? you got Hermit. A hermit was mm -hmm. an individual who had withdrawn to a solitary place. Bro, what the, f what the hell are you going to be? Oh, you, you, you're, you're going to get bounty hunter. After them. As a hermit, you'd be highly capable of looking after yourself. 
Between 43 and 48, you got smuggled. Ain't no butt a smuggler smuggled. was an individual who shipped and exchanged goods with the intent of avoiding taxes or restrictions. The goods were usually high in demand, and more often than not, they were illegal. As a smuggler, you'd be able to sneak past anything. Between 49 and 54, you got a bounty hunter. A bounty what hunter was an individual who was hired to capture and kill a designated <laughs> target. Each target would have a price or bounty that would be the trash man. a successful <laughs> capture or proof of death. As a bounty hunter, you would answer to no one. Now, other. realistically, what the fuck are you going to be? Uh-huh. Maybe a Sith? One. Between 55 and 61, <laughs> you got Crime Lord. Oh the Crime Lord was an individual who was a criminal organization. Their main goal would be to make money and would do so by participating in many illegal activities such as extortion, gambling, I'm better than a bounty hunter. kidnapping, vice cultivation, I'm and bounties. Bounties. Yeah. As a Crime Lord, you would have lots of money and thugs to do your deeds. Yeah, but just 62 thugs. and 70, you got emperor. Damn, you're not far off. There was an individual who ruled over an empire. The main goal of an emperor was to hold, maintain, and increase the power of their empire. They would try to rule over as many planets as possible. Surely as that's an emperor, maximum. Be very There's nothing and above that. Interested in finding out more about who you'd be? All right, let us know in the chat. Would you end up? I was a freaking senator. Can you believe that? Elmer. Guy like me who hates politics. Senator. El nerd. Oh, there it indeed. Peace, love, and light. Deuces and misses. Have a good one.